Hello, my name is Patrick Wheeler, and I'm responsible for product management of Oracle Autonomous Database. This presentation gives an overview of the Autonomous Data Studio. This is a suite of tools built into Autonomous Database that supports self-service analytics such as would be performed by a departmental data analyst. I want to start by debunking a false equivalence. Next, we can review some basic data mart concepts. Then we can talk about some of the things that make Autonomous Database stand out from the crowd. I'll round out with a few next steps. These include some important announcements, so try not to nod off. So, about this false equivalence. Self-service analytics should not mean that you get to build your own analytics stack. The whole point is to avoid the need for IT, not to become IT. Now, let's review some basic data mart concepts. Many of you will be familiar with this, but I think it makes sense to level set. Data at source is rarely in a form useful for analytics and it may not be available locally. For example, the manufacturing system may be the source for the product master. But we need more than that. Information about various campaigns to promote these products comes from the marketing system. And details of individual orders for these various products, and perhaps the campaigns associated with those orders, comes from the sales system. Often, the full picture only becomes clear from the collection of these various fragments of data. Even then, it's probably not in the right form for analytics. Data in these source systems, such as those shown here, is typically organized in third normal form. That's great for transactional systems, but not ideal for analytic processing. For analytic purposes, we typically need to restructure the data perhaps into a star schema, as I show here, with an order item fact table and dimensions for time, product, customer, and campaign. In general, this is the sort of workflow that's required in analytics, whichever platform you may choose to use. You're going to need a collection of tools to help you through this workflow. Now, most of our prominent competitors don't offer a comprehensive suite of tools to help with this. In some cases, they'll propose a solution delivered in kit form. Now, there's some fine print here. Oh yes, some assembly required. I'll say, that can be quite an understatement. A more typical case is what I call the Frankenstack. That can be pretty scary. Here, for example, is an actual competitive solution proposal. In this particular situation, the customer source systems included Oracle and Microsoft SQL Server databases, as well as files of various types. We see these on the left of the slide. Various departmental teams use either Power BI or Tableau for their analytics, as shown on the right. This is quite typical. Across the middle, from left to right, we see the various stages in the analytics workflow. Here you'll note that there is a different technology vendor for each stage through data load, cloud storage, data transformation, and cloud data warehouse. The first question then is, how are you expected to cobble that lot together? But that's only the first question. It gets worse because, of course, there's money involved. You're typically going to have to pay to acquire or consume each of these products. Then you have to train your team to use them all. Next, you've got to manage each component, as well as maintain the interfaces between them. It gets even worse than that. Business executives need to have confidence in the analyses they're presented. An important aspect of that is a clear view of data lineage. What's the source of this information? What's been done to prepare it for this analysis? Likewise, responsible developers need a clear understanding of the potential impact 
of changes to the systems they manage. Agility can be severely impacted if it's hard to identify, consult with, or notify stakeholders in downstream systems. An important problem with this Frankenstack is that each of these interfaces introduces an obstacle to data lineage and an obstacle in impact analysis. So, there are significant disadvantages to these roll-your-own analytics Frankenstacks. It's very often a false economy to select lowest cost components, and you do so at your own peril. For one thing, there are interface complexities. How many vendors are involved in that so-called solution? What's the compatibility matrix between the various components and their various versions? If something goes wrong in one of those interfaces, who are you going to call? Are you going to get caught in the middle of a blame game between vendors on different sides of the interface? You always have to pay attention to the money, of course, and there are lots of expenditures. Paying for acquisition and training. Paying for the staff to deploy, configure, and maintain the stack. And even when it's all up and running, there are the inherent limitations we've just discussed in terms of data lineage and impact analysis. With that backdrop, now let's consider how Oracle Autonomous Database is a truly differentiated service. This is a logical evolution of our converged database philosophy, an integrated solution from a single vendor that includes a built-in data studio. Rather than a complex analytics stack, with all the inherent risk and hidden costs that we've just been discussing, Autonomous Database tremendously simplifies the analytics workflow with a built-in data studio to guide the customer through the various phases. The Autonomous Data Studio includes tools for data loading, data transformation, building business models, preparing insights and data analyses, and the metadata associated with these tasks is stored in an integrated catalog that enables clear data lineage and impact analysis. Here's an example of a customer who's experienced these benefits to their business. Stretchline is a manufacturer of elasticated textiles. They abandoned their previous ETL investments in favor of Autonomous Database's Data Studio. This allowed them to consolidate global data into a central autonomous database. They realized some major benefits. Reports are generated several times faster. Their sensitive data is now stored securely rather than flying around the globe in spreadsheets attached to email. They dramatically reduced their TCO. So in summary, instead of all the chaos associated with unreliable integration among the components of a Frankenstack, the expense of acquiring, deploying, maintaining, and holding it all together, and fumbling around in the dark with no idea of data lineage or dependencies. Autonomous Database has a built-in data studio. It's pre-integrated with a consistent interface and a common set of metadata. It's pre-installed, so there's nothing more to buy and nothing more to install. And the common metadata shines a bright light on data lineage and impact analysis. Data Studio includes tools for data load. For data transformation, powerful enough for the integration demands of a data engineer, but simple enough for the data prep demands of a departmental analyst. Data analysis and a data catalog. There are several announcements about important features that we've added to Data Studio recently. The first is the Data Studio itself. This brings together the suite of tools for self-service analytics into an integrated interface. The studio spans the analytic lifecycle from data load through data transformation and on to data analysis. We've built in workflow capabilities so there's a clear idea about what to do next. Data Transforms is a fully managed data integration solution included with Autonomous Database with nothing more to buy, install or maintain. 
data transformations are simply defined through an intuitive drag and drop interface. It features automatic code generation for application sources including Fusion, NetSuite and Salesforce. There are built-in tools for data quality. You can now run queries on Autonomous Data Warehouse directly from Excel using a new add-in. This includes queries against base tables and a query builder for analytic views. Importantly, no additional client connector software is required. Data Studio includes a built-in data analysis app. Use this to generate, refine, and share semantic business models for analysis. It supports basic visualizations and charts. You can export semantic models defined in this app into your analytic tool of choice, such as Oracle Analytics, Tableau, or Excel. And soon we'll add the ability to build dashboards from saved analyses. So I expect you want to find out some more information. Here are a few of the sites I'd recommend you consult. We have lots of Oracle Live Labs workshops about Autonomous Database, and so much more. Thank you for your attention during this presentation. I hope you found it interesting.